Jenna? Hey, is it here? Yes. Ooh, there cool. you go. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Today is a super exciting. What the? What a noise is this? Listen. We need to check out what this is. I can't make a video on this noise. We finally found a spot where it's calm and peace and quiet. And today we're gonna take a look at a brand new drone. It's the uh, Mavic Pro. No, it's not. This is the old Mavic Mini, the first Mini. And I would like to compare this one a little bit to the DJI Mini 3 Pro. So this is the one we're gonna take a look at. I brought a little knife with me. And, oh, I don't even need to use a knife because they have a little pulling tab here. This is always the most exciting part. That is the take off the first outer protective layer. This is a little tab, it's a little arrow here. No, that pulling tab is actually below this outer plastic case. We need to use the knife after all. I think it should be good enough to find a solution to ship this box without plastic. I wonder how much plastic they actually have for all these boxes. Yeah, there it is. So the casing is kind of made for not having that outer plastic after all. Ready? And this is the drone. Oh, it smells so good. That really nice electronic smell. And here it is, the little tiny one. Let's compare this one to the old first Mavic Mini. It looks bigger. We don't have that lip here, which make it possible for the camera to point upwards in a way that we have never seen before. And here's just to illustrate how much 20 degrees is versus 60 degrees. This is 20 degrees that we are used to from drones. But look here when we increase to 60 degrees instead. It feels like it's almost pointed straight upwards. It's amazing. So on the Mavic Mini, we do not have any backfacing sensors. On the DJI Mini 3 Pro, they are actually here. Just at the back of the front sensors. That's where the back sensors are. So here are the two side by side, the original Mini and the Mini 3 Pro. The first time since the original Mavic, you can capture true vertical videos and pictures. You can see here that it can tilt both ways, that way for portrait mode, and then this way for horizontal mode. And this is what it looks like from the drone when you shoot in horizontal mode, and this is when we switch to vertical mode. Original Mini had just full HD. On the Mavic 3 Pro, you have 4K camera, and that's gonna make a big difference because the issue I had with the original was that you usually can't get so close to the objects, and that's why you maybe need to crop sometimes. And to do that when you don't have 4K, it just creates garbage. Is the battery inside, maybe? And they're like, oh, oh, this is the battery. And here you can see on the battery also that it has Ultralight 249 grams. The thing is by Sweden where I am, they have some fancy regulations when it comes to spreading the video. So if, for example, if I have the horizon, I need to send it in for approval. And there are many other situations where I need to send it in for approval also. It was actually one guy, he had to find, about, I think it was about 35,000 Swedish crowns. It's almost $4,000. Well, other thing I just had to look up was actually true about this. So it was a guy that got his sentence here in the beginning of 2022 he published 15 videos without the permit of dissemination and he got 64,000 Swedish crowns in fine which is equivalent to about $7,000. <gasps> Here's a remote! Look at this one! It's so pretty! It's... oops! This is the iPhone 13 Pro Max and it's not that much smaller. And here, as you can see, you don't have any joysticks but don't, yeah, you're not supposed to steer it like this because they are in the back. It's just... <gasps> Screw it in here. Now you're ready. The joystick feels a lot different also. These ones has a lot less resistance than this ones. So here you have just normal mode, cinematic mode, and sport mode. Turn to home and a pause button. On the back side here you have a button to start filming, and here you have one for take pictures. And here you have these two wheels. One of those two wheels are for zoom feature, because you have up to two times digital zoom when you film in 4K. It's up to four times digital zoom if you film in full HD. One of them is for tilting, and the other one is for the zoom. And here you also have the C1 and C2, custom one and custom two buttons. Turn this one on so we can see what it looks like. This is standard, press, press. 
Oh, it says DJI. Oh, now we're gonna select language. English, Sweden, network, time zone, Brussels. Ooh, it has a speaker. Fly as you are. Let's see if we can start a drone. Here I have parked the little guy. Let's see if we have enough battery because we can't, of course, wait to charge it. But it looks like we have two. There is no battery in the drone when it's delivered, so you really have to charge it. So now we got both on and charged, so we're gonna see how long does it take to set them both up to fly. <gasps> now I see something that I would like to really capture. Let's see how long time it takes to get it up and, and flying. It's still there, let's start with the old Mavic Mini. Let's unpack it, to unfold the antennas, take down that clamp. We have to take the phone out from the case. And we have to try to fit it in here and plug in that cord in the bottom. Oh, and we have to take up the app, DGI. Okay, now we have the app open. We have to start the controller and we have to unfold the drone, take away the lens cover, unfold. Oh, I unfolded the wrong way, of course. I have to take those ones. Hurry, 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 it's still there. Yeah, I think, no, no, it's flying away. Crap. We have to turn on, oh, it's underneath, two taps. Okay, there it is. Okay. Oh no, it's it's not there anymore. The thing that I was supposed to capture. <sighs> Trying to get connected here with, with the app. Okay, now we are up, okay. Prepare to take off. Okay, we have seven satellites. And now we are up. And that took us two minutes and 21 seconds. Now it's time for the new DJI Mavic Pro Mini, Mini 3 DJI Mini 3 Pro. Oh, the thing is there. Now it's important to capture it again. Let's take out the drone, take off this one, unfold it. You don't need to care what order you unfold the arms anymore. We have to turn on the controller first, of course. Double tap and double tap on the drone. And we are down to 22 seconds already. I can even have some time to put on my joysticks while the app is starting up. We can take off. And now it's one minute and 16 seconds. Ah, well, let's, let's do it to one minute and 17 seconds to get up and flying. This is a big difference. This only this feature itself, that it goes so much quicker, is worth it for me. So let's see what different it makes in the sound. Let's start the old DJI Mini first. Take off. Take off. Ooh, listen to that. And it's so much more quiet. And another great new feature is that there is actually new sound. We are used to the old DJI drone startup sound for so long and it sounds like this. But with a new one, it sounds like this. New sound, isn't that cool? And this is so cool with the new drone, it, it bangs when it turns like this, when you're flying. It never did that before. Let's do that again, look here. When we're coming, it really bangs in the air. And this is so handy to be able to switch to cinematic mode here, so oh no, I like to fly a little bit more careful. 
And you can just do that without any problems. So is there anything I miss with the DJI Mini 3 Pro so far? Well, there is one thing that I really miss and that is a better carrying case because this box just doesn't do the trick. It's good to deliver in, but it's not good to carrying it in. So I can drop the link to one of the best alternatives that I have found in the comment box below. And I've also ordered the Flymore combo, but I wasn't in stock when this one was in stock. So I will probably get that anytime soon. But don't leave yet because check out that video on that side because that is the video that YouTube recommend you to watch it next and the video on the other side well that is the last uploaded video i have then you can continue to do that forever just watch the videos over and over again and new videos because new videos are coming over and out from sweden bye